glad I kept a few jumpers out um, whilst I was sorting everything out thinking right I'm gonna put my jumpers away I'm just gonna leave like cardigans and stuff because it's freezing today so cold um, I literally went to bed well I went back to bed because if you watch the last vlog you'll know that I was up at well I was awake at like three in the morning went back to bed at about half past five and I slept in until I'm trying to untangle <laughs> A necklace um i slept in today until about half past 10 and you know when you're like you wake up and i mean chris had been downstairs for a couple of hours and you look at the time and you're like oh my god it's half past 10 and you feel like i know it's ridiculous but you feel like oh my god i've wasted so much time but i haven't i obviously needed to sleep because i was awake at three in the morning um so I managed to get an extra, is that unraveled? No, it's still a bit tangled. Uh, I managed to get an extra four and a bit hours sleep, which is good, which is obviously what I needed. So um, yeah, I feel, I feel fresher today, but it's cold. So yeah, when I went back to bed, I had my pajamas and I had a big cardigan as well. And then the duvet, I was freezing 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 uh anyway good morning <laughs> after a little little waffle there uh i'm just getting ready now because here's me thinking we've wasted the day it's now half past 11 so i've showered done my makeup i've put some little what are these called crimpy curls crimpy this this they're not barrel crimper crimper it's not a crimper though because crimp to me crimpers are like from like the 80s waves these little crunchy waves whatever we call these i'll put those in there i don't know whether to um leave my hair as it is like this i put some dry shampoo in it because i just i didn't wasn't going to wash it this morning it's not too bad is it um no whether to leave it like this i kind of like it like this sort of rough and ready i'll we'll put some clips clips in it i don't know let's let's see mm. oh i don't know i think maybe i'll just do you know what? i'll take them with me and then maybe i should put it on the on the side do you know what i read i read something the other day about you know if you're a woman of a certain age you shouldn't wear a centre parting anymore. I always wear a centre parting. Am I am I doing it? Am I wrong? Am I doing it wrong? Should I have a side? Is it more flattering on the side? All these things. I don't know. I just wear it how I wear it. How my hair falls. Does that look okay? I feel like it kind of looks stupid. <laughs> that little. Should it be the other way? <laughs> I'm leaving it like this. I'm leaving it like this. It's raining outside anyway, so it's gonna get flattened. We're only going into Salisbury. Is this gonna focus? Um, we're only going into Salisbury, so I'll take the little clips with me. In fact, I'll take the clips. I'll take this, just in case it gets on my nerves. I am waffling this morning, aren't I? Waffling, well, I haven't even had any coffee. Um, I haven't even had any breakfast, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have some toast. And then we're going to go into Salisbury, have a little look around, just to get out of the house. Mum needs to take some curtains back to Dunelm. She got some like green curtains. They're like um, they're like a forest green. I'm trying to see like like this colour green, but um, they make her room look really small. So I said, no, you need lighter curtains because she's got green bedding as well. It was just a bit too much, so she needs lighter curtains and um the darker bedding so she's gonna she's gonna take those back and we're just gonna have a little wander around town um might even buy my holiday pants first shop done we've got our holiday toiletries and i'm just discussing skin skin stuff with mum mum's just um been looking for like a cleanser she uses um ole or oil of ule as it used to be called so i think she's gonna try 
this cleanser, but honestly, skincare is a minefield. Okay, I've got holiday stuff in prime right now. All the swimwear, that is nice. Yeah, I like that. That's really nice, that cover up. We could wear that with a swim costume or with like um, a vest top and some jeans. Yeah. That's really nice. How nice is this? Oh, it's nice and stretchy as well. What's the print on it? Hmm. Yeah. I thought we'd come up to the home section and see if they had some more spring homeware stuff, but they don't really have a lot more. They've got like cooler bags, lunch bags, but none of the like crockery that I keep seeing everywhere. We're just in M&S now. Chris has gone to Costa, he's had enough. <laughs> That's a really nice dress. Oh, are these like dupes for the Marc Jacobs tote bag? M&S always do good dupes, don't they? I really like the look of um, like these scalloped edge swimming costumes. I know they've been around for ages, but obviously I'm just seeing them again now. I quite like them. So they got oh a nice animal print one. Oh, here's the dupe for the um is it Louvi? Oh my god, the woman in the shop at the actual shop at Bista Shopping Village told us how to pronounce it and I've forgotten already. Is it Louvé? That's the dupe for that bag. The weather has been so horrible today. Um got rained on several times, but <laughs> Isn't it weird? Whenever I curl my hair with that curler and then my hair gets rained on, it looks better when it's been rained on. I can't quite explain it, but it just, I don't know. <laughs> it's weird. I feel like it looks okay. Anyway, we're home. we've been home ages. We have just had a very chilled Sunday afternoon. Um, we watched um, like a documentary on Anne Boleyn. I love anything to do with Tudor history. So we watched that. That was on Channel 5. Um, and then we started watching Legend. So the Cray twins, like the Tom Hardy film. Really like that film. It's still on downstairs actually. Um, but I mean, I've seen that film probably about 20 times like it just seems to be on the telly and you just sort of get engrossed in it so um mum's finishing off watching it we've put the dinner on we've got pork chops and mashed potato and peas tonight um and i've just come upstairs to put things in their place that we bought today so things that we bought for holiday and stuff so i thought i'd do a little a little holiday haul if you like so from Boots, I got, um, well, I got, oh, mum got that oil of, oil of, no, Ole. I always call it oil of Ule. I always call it oil of Ule. Um, mum has used that for, since I was born, so over 40 years she's used that. I can't use it because it makes my skin come out in a rash for some reason. Um, but she wanted like a facial wash and so we found this cleanser and um it was only four pounds something she thought it was six pound it was marked up at six pound something but the till it was only four pounds something um i got some don't shout at me but i do like these wipes when we go away they're just always handy to have in my toiletry bag so i got some of those i got a deodorant um I got some shampoo. It was three for two on the John Frieda um, blonde shampoo. So I got two shampoos and a conditioner. But I've got some travel bottles. So I don't know whether to um, put some in there. I'm not sure. Or I might just take the big bottles. I got a hairspray to take away. I figured I didn't want the Diddy one. I wanted more of a bigger one. Uh, and then Chris got, what did Chris get? He got a deodorant, a Nivea deodorant, and also um, the Dove one. To be honest, I mean, I bought this one 
but this one's more for my work bag like me and chris tend to share deodorants i've i've said it before i quite like men's deodorant i quite like how it smells so um that's what we got from boots then we went to poundland and stocked up on a few things um oh <laughs> mum wanted some arrows looks like she's already had they're open so I'm sure had an arrow in the back of the car um i needed some toothbrushes like some travel toothbrushes i like these ones i liked the like the black handle so i got some toothbrushes we've got some toothpaste the colgate chris got two we've got two of them uh sensitive whitening one and a repair and prevent one uh got some poo pills always gotta take poo pills when you're away um what else oh i bought i've already got i think four of these and i got another four foot masks these are so good when you've been walking all day just to put one of these on at night just to help the feet repair for another full day of exploring uh, i got some razors uh, oh, they were doing an offer in Poundland. They were two fifty each for more shampoo. But I don't know. I might take these rather than the blonde one because they're smaller. Uh, so I got one of the Argan Argan oil. They had the other one, the rose one. But I quite like this one. So I got a shampoo and conditioner, the herbal herbal essences one. Mum got some of those as well. So there's another another load of those in there. Um, what else did we get? We got a little travel. This is for like a handbag, a little suntan lotion because it is going to be quite warm over there. Um, Chris got a little shaving gel. Uh, I got a little coconut dry shampoo. Some ibuprofen. I think there's a couple of packets of that in there. Yeah. Um, oh, and another, another little handbag size deodorant they're always handy to have aren't they oh got some more batteries because i need to i'm just making sure i picked up the right ones then they look like triple a no i need to change all of the clocks in the house because they've all stopped um oh and we also bought <laughs> don't laugh a little box of yorkshire tea <laughs> because a i love yorkshire tea who doesn't love a cup of yorkshire tea but we've got a little kitchen area in our hotel in Vegas. And if you want to have a cup of tea, I want Yorkshire tea. So we bought some, just a little box of Yorkshire tea bags to take with us. Um, that's it in this bag. I went to M&S and I got uh, my pants. So do you, I mean, do you really want to see my pants? They're just M&S full briefs the five briefs for seven pounds so i got two packets of pants and then i got two packets of the um no show trainer socks i love these socks they're so comfortable um and they're only like i think they're six pounds yeah six pounds for five pairs so i got two two packets of those i've got new socks for holiday as well new socks and pants went into primark i only got a couple of bits in primark um i was really hoping that they would have more homeware stuff in there but it's only a tiny little section at the one in salisbury so i was a little bit a little bit disappointed but anyway what did i get in there i got a foundation brush that was two pounds i bought some eye patches i thought i might put these on on the plane you know when we're just about to land these are like caffeine ones or they might wake me up a bit or something <laughs> so i got those i got some little well, it's a receipt. some little travel bottles we've already got um some of these but i wanted like these are different color ones so i can sort of tell the difference of what i've put in them i suppose i could label them but we want to take with us some um a tea towel a dishcloth and some washing up liquid as well this all sounds so bizarre doesn't it considering you know you can buy it when you're there but why would you want to buy a big bottle when you can just take a little bit like i say we've got a little kitchenette so we're going to be doing breakfasts in our hotel and stuff so we're going to need 
stuff like that. Um, I got a blush from the PS range. I got a, it's like a, it's like a peachy toned one. It's called Desire. It was £1.50. But um, I quite like, quite like the colour of that. So I got a new blush. I got a new lunch bag for work because at the moment I'm using Chris's one. Uh, so I got that. That was £3. I quite like the the green um, check on it. Uh, and then I got some new hair bubbles and some bobby pins, hair grips. Let's hope. Let's hope I don't lose all of these, although we all, we all know it's going to happen. And then um, no summer Primark trip would be complete without a new pair of sunglasses. And I saw these and I thought, yes. These are nice. They are £3.50. Oh, there we go. I look like a mob wife, don't I? <laughs> With the like... Do I look like a mob wife? I don't know. <laughs> well, let's take... Let me take this what, this uh, label off. I'm going to be walking around with the UV label stuck on. But um, I love a big, a big pair of sunglasses. These are nice. Oh, I like them. So they were £3.50. They also did these in a tortoiseshell colour, but I just, I quite liked the black ones. So yeah, and that's, that's everything. No, it's not. No, it's not. I got um, a lipstick, or no, a, a liquid lip, a matte, ugh, a matte liquid lip from Collection in this like mauve shade. What shade is this? Oh, it's called Hustler. Oh, I'm a mob wife and a hustler. Uh, let's pop it on actually, so we can have a little look. I mean, this lighting is not doing it justice, but let's just. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's a really nice color. I like that. Good. That's dried really, really quickly. Oh, there's a little bit on my hand, but look, and that's dried really quick. I'm impressed with that. Anyway, that's that's everything <laughs> that we got today. Quite a lot, actually. You kind of forget what you need to take away. Like you, you automatically think, oh, I've got everything I need. And then when you look in your toiletry bag, you're like, oh, I need to get this, this, this. And so, yeah, it's just it's just been a day of stocking up on stuff for holiday, um, getting a few little other bits. Um, I need to start packing now. So clothes are in the wash that I pulled out, like my summer stuff. I've got my basic stuff as well. I need to think about what to like, what to wear on the plane and stuff. I just I want to be comfortable because it's an eleven hour flight. So I want to be comfortable. Um, so yeah lots to think about i will do a packing video um so that'll be coming in the next couple of weeks um and yeah and this is going to be the last feb vlog although i know when you're watching this you're thinking hang on february's not finished but i plan to do a live stream on friday to just round off the every other day vlogging that i've been doing this month I hope you've enjoyed them. I've really enjoyed doing it and I can't wait to do it again. Uh, like I say, next month is gonna be a little bit, I mean, I will try to do some more vlogging over the next couple of weekends and sort of edit them and slice them up and put them, you know, pepper them around May time. Um, so I will try, because we've got a couple of bits that we're doing. So we're gonna go and watch a comedian. Um, what else are we doing? We've got a couple of other bits. You know, plus there's going to be a packing video, I'm going to do a try on video, um, I'm going to try to do a Peloton review video, although I'm kind of running out of time so I might have to do that after I get back from holiday. Um, so yeah, lots of things, obviously you'll have all of the holiday vlogs, but yeah, this is the penultimate Feb vlog and then the last one will be a live stream. I just thought I haven't done one for such a long time so what better way than to just round it up, say thank you for watching, chat to you guys. It'll be 
at seven o'clock in the morning so i know some of you do watch my vlogs when i upload them at seven so if you're around then tune in i'll be doing my makeup getting ready for the day so yeah hope to see you guys there um and yeah anyway i better go because i need to sort of put all these things into different places and then um finish off the dinner and just chill for the rest of the evening so yeah anyway thanks for watching take care and i'll see you on friday morning at seven o'clock i'll see you there